biggest question now facing all 12th class intermediate second year students people who are, who are passing out this year is when are the competitive exams going to be held because uh, there is no clarity yet on uh, when the remaining two je main slots when are they going to happen then neat so this is the biggest question uh the nta also has not made any announcements so far but uh, we are expecting them to give some clarity at least by the end of this month in the meanwhile the 12th class exams uh, cbsc isc and several state governments uh, state boards uh, all of them have got cancelled so the only thing that the students look forward to at this stage is when are all these exams going to be held so one clue to understanding this particular uh, question uh, we've got yesterday when the clack consortium that is the uh, national law universities that is the collection of national law universities have announced yesterday that the common law admission test the date they have announced yesterday the common law admission test the common law admission test is going to be held in an offline mode on july 23rd so july 23rd will be the date for the first all india test for students passing out of 12th class so this is an indication of how things will shape up in the future so based on this we can roughly estimate that any time after july 23rd that is the last week of july or the first week of august we can have the je main and perhaps a few weeks after that neat exam so the next question is whether there will be two uh, slots for je main because uh, february and march versions were conducted the april and may versions were pending so that is of only academic interest because even if the two slots are made available for the students this time the gap between the two slots will not be too very much uh, they may be conducted within a gap of 20 25 days if they are conducted so for a student for all practical purposes i think a student can assume that any time from last week of july to first week of august would be the likely date for je main and prepare accordingly so if this is true if this is what is going to be the likely date for je main then je advanced definitely will be conducted sometime in the first week of september or last week of august most probably first week of september so which means those students who are preparing for je advanced seriously they've got a uh, remaining part of june july and august so approximately around two and a half months for je advanced so based on this assumption um, students can go ahead and plan their preparation so at this stage please do not wait for the nta authorities to announce the dates just go ahead uh, with the assumption that the exams will definitely be conducted towards the end of july or early august and go ahead i think that should set at rest uh, a whole lot of speculation about the dates a um, lot of students uh, are going through a process of drift the most dangerous thing at this stage is to drift aimlessly so you should take charge of yourself motivate yourself maybe you will not be able to spend 12 to 14 hours every day doesn't matter but spend some time productively because as i've been telling previously the most important thing at this stage is uh, being in touch with the subject and uh, if you are better than the remaining if most of the st other students are off focus at least if you stay focused uh, you will be in a better position in competitive exams what matters is not how you perform alone what matters is how you perform relative to the others so the others are at zero and if you are at one you get selected so keep that in mind keep yourself motivated don't bother too much about 
the dates. Definitely the exams are going to be held. So this has given us a clue as to when the exams will be held. So based on that, plan your preparation. Don't waste time at this stage. If, if you are waiting for some kind of announcement, just stop waiting. If you are bothering about whether there will be two slots or one slot and things like that, don't worry about that. Your preparation has to be there only for one exam, whether it is in one slot or two slots, that shouldn't matter for you. So go ahead and uh, plan your preparation, give the finishing touches and be ready in all aspects, not merely for JE Mail, also for JE Advanced. Okay, all the best.